In this quick lesson, we're going to look at a setting that's been added to iPadOS 15.4. From the Settings app and Sounds, we now have a Fixed Position Volume Control toggle here at the bottom. So with this activated, when the iPad is in portrait orientation like so, the top volume button on the right side of the device will increase the volume and the bottom button is going to lower the volume. When I rotate to portrait orientation, the buttons retain the same commands, but they're not very intuitive. What's now the left button will increase the volume and the right button lowers it, which seems backwards. Rotate again to portrait orientation, but with the volume buttons now in the lower left of the iPad, and the top button will lower the volume and the bottom button will increase it. iPads with a home button, like this one, are probably not going to be used upside down like this very often. But iPad Pros and newer iPad Air and iPad Mini models don't have a home button and they can be easily used in any orientation. So what we can now do is deactivate the fixed position volume controls, which will make them dynamic. Now with the volume buttons in the upper right, they're going to work the same as before. But when moved to landscape orientation, the buttons are dynamically switched. The left button will lower the volume and the right button will increase it. Rotate again with the volume buttons in the lower left and the top button is going to boost the volume and the lower button will decrease it, which makes a lot more sense. So now no matter how you're holding the iPad, whatever volume button is on the top or to the right of the other button is going to increase your volume. Remember that you do need to be running iOS 15.4 or later for the fixed position volume controls toggle to appear. And you can learn much more about your iPad in our full iPadOS tutorial. One other thing, this lesson has kind of shown off how useful an origami iPad case is. These cases have front flaps that can be folded into a variety of positions that allow the iPad to be set up in any orientation at different angles. I find origami cases like this to be super useful. I'll link to a couple options below this video. Thanks for watching.